Hey guys, Master Proponent Zero here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to get the Wonder Wolf every single time glitch on the giant Black Ops 3. The first thing you need to do to start the glitch is to open up the entire map, highly recommended at the lowest round possible. Now, you also need to make sure that Deadshot is your extra perk. If it isn't, you have to restart. Now, the first thing you need to do is you need to make sure you got a Drake on, or any sniper rifle for that matter, and you need to shoot all these red lights. Try not to miss, and if you miss, I will personally come to your house and flood your room with shit. Now, once you've hit all those lights, make sure to headshot the zombie. It's okay if you miss. Once you've headshot the zombie, quickly initiate the link to the mainframe and get the teleporter up and running. This is highly, highly suggested because Pack-A-Punch will, and I mean it will, be needed for this next step. The power-up will drop here, but wait, don't grab it! The game knows that you're trying to do the glitch, so they give you a power-up, but it's actually made of piss and dildos, and if you pick it up, a gay boxer will come to your house and beat your ass in both the right way and the wrong way. Once you've got Pack-A-Punch opened, all the teleporters are activated, and you've hit the red lights. Before you hit the box, you need to throw two grenades in the furnace and run away quick before they kill you! If they kill a zombie, you get bonus points. Now hit the box, shoot it three times, knife it, teabag it, and you should get the dredge. I'm gonna open now what you're now. gonna need to do with the dredge is quickly run over to the catwalk. While you're at the catwalk, you need to hit this light, this light, and it's okay if you swap weapons just to kill zombies because you cannot use the dredge to kill any zombies. You need to shoot this light and the final one here. Now you need to wait two hours. Once you've waited two hours, quickly run over to the box. Once you've made it over to the box, make sure you have any shotgun with you first, preferably the Haymaker or the Brecky because you're gonna need to fire rate. The dogs will always spawn on this very round because the game knows you are doing the glitch. When you kill one dog, grab the loose chain, double tap, and then you spawn the dogs. Pick up the max ammo and go over and hit the box. But before you hit the box, you need to shoot these three really quickly. Shoot the question marks and then quick shoot the box five times, turn around and you should get the Wonder Waff. But wait, that's a fake Wonder Waff. Don't pick it up, it's actually fake. It's, it's made out of nightmares and also jizz. So don't pick up that Wonder Waff because that one is fake. So what you need to do is to go over to the catwalk once again and you need to purchase the Bowie Knife. Sweet. Once you have enough to buy the Bowie knife, go ahead and purchase it and move on to the next area. The next thing you need to do is to activate the Easter egg song. How you do that, perhaps? I'm gonna search up a fucking YouTube video. Once you've activated the music, quick, turn your game audio and change the music to zero. Now that we've done that, the next thing that we need to do, we can kill the zombies now with the Bowie knife points are acceptable now. And we must end the round with only the Bowie Knife. Once you have ended the round with the Bowie Knife, go back over to the catwalk, swap to any weapon of choice, and sit there, camp for two hours. Once you have waited the full two hours, the game knows you are doing the glitch, and will make sure that no zombies spawn until you move. Just keep racking up points until you get enough. Once you have gotten enough points, any amount is acceptable. Take the Dracon and shoot the four lights here. And then, move over to where the box is. Take your dredge, 
or any weapon of course, take your haymaker actually, and shoot the box seven times, or whatever number the round is, slide over, aim at the box, look over, and you should get a VMP. Make sure to trade out your dread because you will not need it. Now that you have the VMP, go over to the VMP wall by knife it because you don't need to buy the weapon. And go over to the furnace, throw one more grenade in there, and then hit the box. Expend all your ammo first at the box before you hit the, the box. But try to make a crawler because this shit is going to be annoying. Very nice. Now that you have a crawler, go ahead and hit the box half your ammo before, half your ammo during. Knife it, teabag, spin around, and then you should get the teddy bear. Now quickly, teabag the crawler before the box goes away. Once you're done teabagging, don't get too excited. Move over to where the box will be. For example, the box will definitely be over by the power area, and if it isn't, you need to restart a total of 30 times. Why isn't it here? Is this supposed to spawn here? I did the glitch right, but... I realized my mistake. The box doesn't spawn at the power, it instead spawns here. I've restarted infinite amount of times, and it only spawns here when you're doing the glitch. Now, shoot the box twice, reload, knife, teabag, go to the left side of the box, run around, and you should get the brekkie. Now, what you're gonna need to do with the brekkie, shoot the goblin four times, and then hit the box again, and then hit the gobble gum quickly before it's too late, and then you should get the weevil, Little pick up the weevil, and go over to the gobble gum, don't pick it up, just go over to it, the game will know what you are doing. Now, because you don't have enough points to hit the box, there is one more thing we must do before the round ends. We must buy oh, the RK5, yeah, go over to pack a punch, and shoot the cylinders. And then shoot the zombie. If it spawns a carpenter, you, that means you know you're doing the glitch correctly. Carpenter. And again, That'll buy us shoot some time. the dick joke like, you know, on the back punch so it stops the distance. Get rid of it permanently. And also this one too. Now, once you are done with that, get enough points to hit the box, reload all your weapons, and then the glitch will continue. Once you have enough points to hit the box, make sure to hit it while you're holding the haymaker. Spend all your ammo before the lake. Obtain a liquid div You should get the Gorgon. Trade out your RK5. Take like the several probably the the chest. one of the worst LMGs to have in zombies. And then go over to the lightning room while you're holding the Gorgon. Throw two grenades into the electricity. Try not to blow yourself up. Shoot that green light, that green light, and then that zombie's head. Now, you must shoot these four green lights. Try not to miss. Then, go over to the teleport and do not move for five consecutive minutes. Once it has been five consecutive minutes, you will now be permitted to go and hit the box. And it also Sexy should be a dog round. If it's not a dog round, you hear that restart. Cow dogs. Those fire barrels will, and I repeat, will be important. Next thing you need to do, hit the box, hit that green light, then run over, knife. You should get the locust. This is going to be very, very important. If you do not get the locust, you have to live wrong, regardless of any signs that you've done it correctly. Hit that green light. That dog, that dog should get stuck there. If it's not stuck there, you've done the glitch wrong. Shoot this gobble gun machine right on the yellow light. Miss completely. Shoot the lamp. Go over here. Shoot this fire barrel. Knife it. Not in that exact order. Go over to this side over here. Shoot that light right there. Shoot this light right there. And then the dog should respawn. Shoot that fire barrel. Then knife it. Then go over to this lamp right here. Knife the lamp, back it. Go side by the dog. Go over it. Shoot this lamp right here. Knife it. Teabag it. And then, shoot that dog right there. Shoot 
I'm trying to see the place a couple times. But that's a part of the stats. Once you've gotten your max ammo, your weapon should all be fully reloaded. If they are not, Ronald McDonald will come to your house and force you to look at some of the worst images imaginable. That is subjective to who you are. Shoot the Scalpica machine, shoot it again, hit the box, you should get the teddy bear. Shoot it in the crotch twice, one for each testicle. Once you've done that, the box will then proceed to move on to a different location. This one, however, is undetermined. However, it has an increased chance to spawn right here. Now, if it doesn't spawn here, there will be a completely more difficult set of steps you need to complete in order to do the glitch. Try not to die to zombies. And the next thing you need to do is kill all the zombies. Put most of the headshots and don't die Double like I'm about points. to right now. Shoot him up better, but right before the zombies, right before the round ends, make a crawler because this will be very important oh, and very convenient. Kill any remaining oh, zombies that are walking, then go over to the box and then proceed to hit it. But wait, before you hit it, you must jump off this slide. Go over to this camping spot, and any piece of fire that you see, you must shoot once with the drake on. Look at that crawler over there. Knife, run back, get back to the crawler, shoot that zombie right over there, teabag it three times. If you do it any more than that, you will fail, and you will, you will have a heart attack. Hit the box, shoot at the drake on, shoot it with the haymaker, shoot it with the locust, and you should get the brekkie. Trade out Let's your haymaker flesh open. for the brekkie, and proceed to aim at that particular hex. Shoot it three times. Hit the box. Nice. And empty your mag. You should Yo, get the ICR. Time to meet now, your maker. go over to this gobble gun machine, yeah. and then knife it. Hit it here, here, here. All the yellow belt, all the yellow light bulbs. And then make sure they're not lit for the the right hand side of the lit bulbs when you shoot them and the top one. Empty the rest of your mag into the box. You should a get little light, the weevil, but it deals out the death just the fine. Crawler. Go over to this barrier, rebuild one window. Key back the crawler a total of four times this time. Any less than that, and the crawler will become John Cena and beat your ass in real life. Now go over back to the box. Don't hit it though. Shoot it here. Both question marks. Knife it. Shoot these three boxes. Run over to the mainframe. Once you're back at the mainframe, try to slide into the pack a punch. Do this a total of however many times it takes for you to be able to pack a punch yourself. In my case, it was three times. See how it's free? Because pack a punching yourself and bettering yourself is always free. It doesn't take anything more. Then shoot the pack a punch because it gave you a free upgrade. The rest of your magazine. And then go back to the box and hit it one final time. And now, after all this dedication, you should be able to get the Wonder Rock. But wait, for me, 50 for you, chance. Remember, ass. if you don't end up getting it, then that means you must redo the last few steps again with the weapon you've been able to obtain. Try not to end the round. Once you've ended the round, shoot these three boxes again. Shoot them again in the opposite order. Shoot this one three times. Knife the box, spin around, shoot, knife, teabag, grenade, grenade, shoot the grenades before they explode, and then camp here for five consecutive hours without moving and holding the ADS button down. Once you've waited five consecutive hours, throw your grenades, kill all the zombies before, and do not, and I repeat, do not get hit once by the zombies. Do, you will fail in glitch, and you will have to restart. After Rapid all this hard work, you still won't get it. About. You might as well just restart. But wait, this glitch goes longer than you expected. 
it's just like a game theory video. It's okay to get hit once if you've already hit the box for something that isn't a wonder off. Hit the box, headshot all the zombies in your vicinity. You should get the Argus, the sniper of shotguns. Kill all the zombies with the Argus, keep hitting the box. Get, you should get the Weevil, but don't pick it up. You don't need it. We actually need the Argus more than ever. Go and shoot any lamppost that is not on the ground. Once you're done with the lamppost step, next thing you need to do is repair each barrier once, shooting this lantern twice. Knife this trap, go over to the furnace, and then teabag, knife, shoot once, and then get out. By now, it's round 12. Round 12 is the guaranteed round for Wonder Waff Obtain. Once you've gotten to round 12, performing the various steps that I have done in the glitch, make sure to have any sniper rifle, semi or not, and prone at the catwalk and camp here for a consecutive three hours. If you do not camp here for three hours, you will definitely fail the glitch and also die in real life. Now, the next step, you must hit the box while prone still. You should finally, after all these years, the get the Wonder Waff DG2. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see all you guys in the next one. If this clip didn't work for you, that's because it's a joke. But if you actually fell for this, you're a stupid nit!